Yo, what's up guys, and in this video we're going to be opening up a booster box of Shining Fates. In total, we have exactly 36 booster packs there. These came out of 7 tins, and then I took one spare pack out of a Pikachu box to make 36. So I sacrificed those tins to bring you guys this opening, obviously, in my custom booster box. I hope you like my arts and crafts, but obviously, Shining Fates is a subset or a holiday set. So it only comes in collection boxes or tins. It doesn't get a booster box or blisters, etc., like Vivid Voltage or, say, Cosmic Eclipse. It's more like Hidden Fates and Shining Legends, those sort of holiday holiday subsets and yeah obviously I did one with champions path I did a booster box opening just opening 36 packs and a custom made booster box I just cut up an ETB sleeve and then made this let me know what you think of that does it look alright um, obviously it's a bit tricky but yeah I made it do I stole the idea of unlisted leaf he said to me he's gonna do a 36 pack opening because I hooked him up with 36 packs so he can do a booster box opening as well so I thought let me jack the idea because I actually stole the idea from him last time when we did champions path booster box opening so shout out to unlisted leaf uh, you'll see him opening 36 packs I hooked him up with uh, so if you want to see that make sure to check out his channel I'm gonna upload this after his one so uh, let's see if we can pull the Charizard from our 36 packs our Shining Fates custom booster box. Yeah, let's go forth from the back. Let's take it easy. We've opened so much Shining Fates. Um, if you're new here, make sure to like, make sure to subscribe. Um, but, oh, I forgot to even show you our Charizard count. So after this uh, pack, I'll show you how many Charizards we currently have at the time of recording this video. Uh, so we've got Tutel, Nikit, Grookey, Yanma, Morpeko, and then we've got Sincino. I always think I pronounced this wrong, I probably am. And then a Dell Mize VMAX, so not too bad. Two hits there. So, boom, let's get these sleeves down here. So, sleeve that Dell Mize and this baby shiny. So, straight away, we got a double banger for you guys. But yeah, so our current Charizard count right now is five, as you can see there. So far, we pulled one from an ETB, one from a Pikachu V Box and three from tins and majority of these packs come from tins i don't know why maybe i've opened more tins than i have pikachu boxes but i think i've opened a nice amount of both i think i opened an equal amount of both the same with the etbs uh yet i got most of my charizards from the tins so that kind of shows you something there'll be a video of me pulling each single one of these on the channel uh maybe before or after this video uh, I'm not sure if all of these videos have been uploaded yet because I'm just gonna might spread them out a bit But those are our Charizard account and let's see if we can get one another one today uh, Come on guys. Let's see What the pull rate's saying? We might we need to go a bit quicker it is 36 packs So four from the back. Let me know what you get from the code cards if you pull a Charizard Make sure to let me know down below from the code cards, but uh, if you're new here, make sure to like and subscribe. We do big openings, loads of openings, a variety of openings. We open so many different sets on this channel. Try and switch out, but obviously it's boom, double, another double whammy. Obviously, it is uh, Shining Fates week. Today is Monday. It released last Friday, so it's been four days since release. And in four days, we managed to pull five Charizards. Obviously, over those last four days, we opened quite a lot of product. And yeah, all the singles you might see in the back or in my previous openings will be on my eBay. So if you want to complete your set, uh, I try and put it as the lowest on eBay at the time of uh, up listing to give everyone like, that's what I do. I sell uh, singles. Obviously to sell singles, you need to open a lot of boxes. Uh, so yeah, so it helps you guys get your cards, complete your set, get the cards you need. But yeah, let's see what else we can get. We've got Nickit, Spinarak and Celebi, but nothing in that pack. Um, but yeah, if you want to join our YouTube membership, uh, it's our disc. Uh, you get access to our private Discord through the YouTube membership, and that actually on there is like me and the rest of the community that have joined. Like a lot of the new members and older members are just helping each other with finding links. It's been so great since uh, release week. So make sure to join, guys. It's been so <laughs> you need to see the successes, the amount of things everyone's been copying has been crazy, but. We'll just say reverse and a greedent. So, yeah, the Discord, uh, to get access to it, you have to join the YouTube membership. And then once you join the YouTube membership, you link your YouTube and your Discord together. And then there should be a join button under connections. Because I get asked that a lot how to join once they have signed up. So, yeah, after you sign up to YouTube membership, just go to user settings, 
connections and then click YouTube and connect it all up should work from there but let's get back into this opening I thought I'll let you guys know in case you're curious but literally every single day members down below confirm this with me have we been copying shining fates I think since like the last couple weeks but topical whammies again what Cramorant and a cinder race so not so bad we get a lot of double whammies decent decent but let's see how long that lasts because you know our you so when we get a lot of good there's also a lot of bad so um you'll never know we'll see show you the pull rates as well pretty much you can tell this is seven um tins worth of pulls plus one extra pack from a pika box uh, maybe imagine the one extra pack i don't know where i put it i just put it all together but imagine that one extra pack had the charizard in it but now creamy full art really really doing well really happy with how this is going so far pull rates wise want to see a full art shiny at least your predictions down below um i want to see at least three full art shinies for the 30 one in every 10 should be possible that's like one in every two tins nearly but that should be possible in my opinion like we could get that um i don't know how many t packs we open now how many tins worth is that i think less than uh two so far but snom and mananfi so nothing in that one uh, this one's not moving so it doesn't move just go to the bottom you don't want to damage your cards if you just <laughs> last time I, I think i pulled last time we pulled the chairs i just went like and i think i, <laughs> I could have damaged the chairs out so i always said that before the chair like before i pulled done that i always said don't do it just flip it around but then when we have a chair in the pack obviously i didn't know there's a chair in the pack i almost destroyed the chair but oh well uh, i think i had a long day just opening so much but nick it tutor and bosses all the nothing in there anyways uh but boom, boom. and let's see what we can get here four from the back um let me know what other cards you're going for obviously i've said mentioned in previous videos what other cards i like um Rillaboom VMAX is my second favorite trying to get three of those so I need one more of those to have a nice three of them and I think I'll stop at three of oh it's just an Indeedy and a Rillaboom Hollow so let's leave these both up so yeah and I haven't pulled the Rillaboom V shiny which is insane like I think don't quote me on this but maybe we'll like three quarters to a thousand so like 750 packs we've opened maybe maybe more maybe less but last time I counted, it was about 500, maybe six. Um, so, yeah, I've lost track of how many I've opened. I just got to add up all the videos that I have on my hard drive and work out how many packs per video and then add it all up. So that's what I did last time. It came to about 523, but obviously we opened many, many more since I did that. But then, boom, Bunnelby. We have five Charizards in four days. Is that a record? Because I haven't seen many people posting a lot of it. Obviously, it's a hard set to get. Um, most stores and people that sell singles probably are selling the Charizard as well. Me, myself, I, I can't let go of a Charizard. That's why I do this for. I do it to chase the Charizard. So I'll at least keep the Charizard and I can give you guys the singles on our eBay. We've been selling singles for like three years now. Over 10,000 singles we have sold on our eBay. If you didn't know that, then boom. We've never had a negative feedback from all those singles we sold. So gives you a reassurance to who you can shop with but come on first half we need one oh, we got one full art shiny come on, can we get another one come on we got elder goss eevee oh gossy flooder yanma why am i grabbing two q font is a wyvertel uh, amazing rare so not too bad amazing rare wyvertel and then indeedy hollow rare so boom let's go for from the back but yeah guys what baby shinies you going for uh my favorites obviously the sweet coon but i want to get the rillaboom and teleon and cinderace like that trio starter the grookey uh score bunny and uh sobble and obviously the evolution the middle evolution i always forget the name of but oh so yes boom double whammy so we are getting um two full art shinies per row which is a good sign because that's what I want to get. Obviously, I would have want more, most as much as possible. But you'll never know until you do open them up. But boom, boom. Let's go four from the back. And then we got Cramorant. 
Rust Shield, Elder Goss, more Peko, Spinarak, Bizzle, Rowlet. I might have to pick up the speed. Oh, there we go, Sobble. Obviously, I've got one of these in my collection already. There's a lot of edge wear on these, so I don't know if you can see that. But you can see that silvering. you got to watch out that. Me being an honest seller, a lot of these will have it. Like, it's going to be impossible or very hard to find a baby shiny without that. My sweet coon that I kept for my personal collection, the only sweet coon I pulled out of the hundreds of packs I opened. And my favorite baby shiny, and it's got like some white bits on the bottom. So you gotta watch out. If you want more pictures, I'm sending like 15 pictures to a guy after this video. He asked me for 15 pictures for a lot of cards because he wants to grade them. I uh, see so he said, um, he asked me, can he? And I was like, yeah, sure, why not? Of course, I want them to be happy when they arrive. I don't want them to um, be upset. Like, ah, oh, well, I thought it was gonna be better condition, obviously. Show them everything. If you want more pictures, always ask me. But I don't know why I'm trying to sell singles. Maybe because I just listed all my singles for Shining Fates. I listed the V Maxes, the Vs, the Shiny Babies, uh, the promos, the full arts, uh, the Shiny full arts as well that I don't keep in my personal collection. Last night, all the way from. Um, obviously I stayed up all night till 6am and I did still haven't gone to sleep actually So that's the grind we're putting through for this channel and for you guys But Kyoga, amazing, rare So that's why I'm trying to push the single so I'll make that hard work worth it So two amazing rares, can we get Reshiram? Then we have the full set of amazing rares in this opening But can we get two, was it, this is the, I think there's one more pack left um, And then that's row number one done but I like doing this, maybe we'll do this. I haven't done this with Hidden Fates. Have I done a 36 pack opening with Hidden Fates? I think I have actually, way back when I started the channel, so make sure to check that out. But Eevee and Glaring Wheezing. So, boom. And our last pack. Perfect. Ooh, I don't want to spoil that. There you go, Floatzel, Rusted Sword, Luxio, El Grookey as well, Bizzle, Yanma, Trapping, Shinx, ooh, just Yanma and a Manamphi. So, two full art shinies so far, a bunch of, uh, just a, I think there's one full art there, a couple baby shinies, but let's get into second row, another 18 packs left. Uh, Cherizard up to start with, can we get a Cherizard in this half of the box? Come on, let's hope so, because I want to see one. Focus out for you guys by Elder Ghost, Jim Trainer, Horsey, Q Font, Chutel, Yanma, Morpeka, or just a reverse and Bird Keeper, full art, so not too bad. I finally seen it full art. Skylar, I think I've out all the packs I opened. I pulled five Charizards, yet I've only pulled two Skylars. So maybe that's quite a hard one to do, but obviously there's a couple full arts you gotta pick, uh, pull from. But the other ones, I got I got a few of some of the other ones. Oh, like five six or some of them so uh, maybe the Skylar is less like more limited than the others like I got more Charizards V maxes than I have of other V maxes so the pull rates are a bit you don't know you could be winning you could be losing but we'll see uh, we've got Bolton here some guys in discord be pulling the Charizard in under 50 packs other guys take up like up to 200 packs so um, you never know, it could be in that first tin you pick or the last tin you pick, you never know where it's going to be, but um, yeah, let's see what we got here, boom, four from the back, yeah, I just love these booster box openings, I think I did a good job with the booster box, let me know, I'll show you the booster box, how I did it at the end, it's just a cut up of the sleeve of the ETB and then I stuck it onto a deep darkness of blaze booster box, but a Frostmoth and a Volcanion, come on, we need some Full art hits. We opened quite a few on this side already and haven't got much full art hits in my opinion. So let's hopefully we can get some now. Uh, we've got Floatzel, Horsey, Yanma, Morpeko, Coughing. Alright, what? Ooh, I was looking at the number. So I know 107 is the Cherizard, right? I don't even know what it is. What is it? It's 107, yeah. Because I haven't looked it up on eBay, so I'm not sure what the value or what the code was. Because usually when I type it on eBay, I remember it. But Volcanion. Um, but yeah, another full art shiny. Decent, but no VMAX shiny. So the Vs are more easier to pull than the VMAX. The VMAX shinies are the more limited ones, if you didn't know that. Uh, more harder to get. But it's some, sometimes it's harder. Like I said, I pulled four. I've got four Rillaboom VMAXs in total. Uh, but I've never pulled the regular V Rillaboom, so it's like, what are the pull rates? <laughs> but the, in, uh, I think in, uh, what you call it, in um, Shiny Star V, there was more V 
uh, full art shinies than there was shiny V maxes. So it was more likely to pull a V, and I think that's the same ratio as here. Uh, but we got Rowlet. Ooh, Glaring Weezing. Nice one there. I like Glaring Weezing. I checked on eBay. I think I've put it for about six, seven pounds, whatever those cheapest price on eBay was. I listed it at that. So if you want to help support the channel, make sure to buy these singles. Uh, we do it for you guys. You get your singles. We can put the money back into buying more packs, etc. And yeah, hopefully we can help you guys out with your collection. I know um, Hadders in our Discord helped him. He, he needed two baby shinies left to complete his uh, Shining Fates Curse set. And yeah, we sorted him out with those last two. And boom, Cacnea, Shinx, Coughing, and a Crobat V. So, battery's almost dead. Let me replace it quick and we'll get back into this opening. Boom, back again. Let's focus up. Yeah, I think what did we record today? We recorded Rebel Clash 30 pack opening, Unified Minds 12 pack opening, Mix 20 pack opening. I think we did some Champions Path in the morning, but no, we did four pins as well earlier. Four pins, three hidden fates. There we go, yeah. We did quite a few videos today. I think we did some more, but I just can't remember. Um, but yeah, all of them all transferred to the hard drive already, so you will see them in the future. But Qfont and the Decidueye, Hollow Rare. So yeah, this is what happens. We open like multiple times a day, different sets. Um, so we did like today, nine videos. So if I was to do one day, it takes nine videos. Another day, I'll do another five videos. And yeah, I won't have enough days in the year to upload all my videos, all my openings. Uh, that's why I've uploaded twice a year, um, twice a day this year in the beginning. Obviously, it's Shining Fates, so I'm uploading one a day for about a week or two until Shining Fates cools down, then I'll upload two a day again. Um, but yeah, what I'm doing is uh, for the two a day videos, I'm putting short ones in the morning and then longer ones in the evening so we can just get through uh, most of our videos and then we can start doing one a day, nice big long one a day video, something like this, maybe a bit better, but ooh, treadmill. This is all we got left, guys. Can we pull a Zard number? Zard number six we need. But come on, let's go. And we need a second full art. How many full arts we got? I think we pulled one here. Yeah, we did. We got the Grim Snarl on this side. So we, we got three full arts already. Like I said, I wanted two. At four, I said I wanted four, so two in each side would be a nice ratio. So let's see what we can get. We got Snarl, all Sanaconda, and Boss's Order. So boom, Sanaconda. And yeah, I opened some Hidden Fates today and I opened some Hidden Fates yesterday as well. Um, I don't know, I enjoy Shining Legends more. I enjoy Shining Fates more than Hidden Fates. I think maybe because the pull rates are better, so you're more excited. The probability of you getting something is good. Whereas Hidden Fates, I think the pull rates are less better, but it has a better variation of Pokemons. Because this is obviously mainly Gen 8, the Sword and Shield Gala region Pokemons. Um, whereas uh, Hidden Fates had a mixture of Pokemons and you had a lot of like Gen 1, 2, 3, etc. But boom, Indeedee Hollow. And my favorites are Ho Ho in there, Lucario's in there, um, obviously the Cherizard's in there. There's a bunch. I need to do a PSA and a submission collection, my Hidden Fates collection video, because obviously some are in binders, some are in grade fits. Um, and all semi rigids, it depends which brand ones I used, but um, depending which ones are, and then some are in so, so some of my Hidden Fates collection is in binders, uh, some are in semi rigids, and some of them are just graded and slabbed already. So uh, I think last time I did a PSA, why is this Grookey upside down? Okay, that's all upside down, but glaring Casola there, um, but yeah. I sent a few off Hidden Fates Full Arts last time. I think I sent like four or five of them in my last PSA submission. And I have a returns video. Oh, that's crimmed on the top, but that just looks like the code card. Hopefully nothing special has been crimmed. Nothing looks crimmed there, so let's see what we can get. So crimmed is when it gets stuck. So crimmed is when it gets stuck. Oh, the, the front card's actually crimmed, as you can see in the front. You see with the shadow on there, you can see the little crim lines on there. That's because it got stuck when they're sealing the pack. So it looks like the dart tricks. So I'll put that aside. I'll probably just have to go in the bin because it's pretty much damaged card now. But the others look good. Uh, nothing wrong with the backs because I checked the backs earlier. But Naked Horsey, let's see Rusted Sword and Bird Keeper. That Bird Keeper is alright. I just want to make sure if it's damaged or not. If it's damaged, then I'll say error printed crimson card on our eBay listing just to make sure it has an accurate description but 
Come on, let's get some more Charizards. Come on. What else is there? Obviously, the Ritalin V full art. I don't know what's going on with that. I just might buy two, three of eBay. Because how have I not pulled that one card off the... Ooh, okay, Crobat V, not too bad. Um, after opening so much packs, like, I haven't got that one. I'm sure there's a... I want to check it in a bit. Hold on. All right, let's see what's in here. We got Tropius, Gym Trainer, Luxio, Horsey, Yanma, Morpeko, Coughing, Gossy Fleur, Qfont, and Manamphi. But, well, let's go in here quick. Hold on. Yeah, there is a Rillaboom Full Art Shiny, but I've never pulled that. I've never seen that. I literally pulled every single Full Art Shiny, but that Full Art, so... Bruh, I was starting to doubt myself. I had to pull that out to just reassure myself it exists. I thought I was going crazy for a second. I was like, no way we haven't pulled that. Like, we pulled five Charizards. I can't pull one bloody Rillaboom. You know what I mean? But, oh well, let's see what we can get here. And yeah, like I said, this might be my last Shining Fates video I'm recording, but I have about 30, 40 uh, Shining Fates videos or boxes in total or whatever. I don't, I'm not even sure. I probably lost count, but we have a lot of uh, Shining Fates videos to go live so they all go live in random orders so you'll see loads of shining fates on this channel so if you're here for that make sure to definitely subscribe because we will have some quality content quality pulls like i said we pulled every single card near enough but that really been full art i don't know why it's evading us um but yeah come on let's go to wacky ball guy tropius i don't think i'll buy a raw one as well because i'm still opening packs still got more to get I don't think it's going to increase in price. If anything, it could go down. But Celebi, two packs left, guys. We got the Charizard pack out last. Come on. Let's get something. Boom. And there we go. We got Rotom, Floatzel, Rusted Sword, Trapinch, Snom, Grookey, Spinarak, Shinx. There we go. Our ratio has been hit. Like I said, I wanted to hit two full art shinies per row. And we did it in this we got the ditto full art so nicely done there all right so boom there we go let's see what we can get here we got float soul rusted sword luxio nick hit rowlet trap pinch bizzle coughing or oh, ev and okay we got camera to end it off then at least it's a hit, but let's get into our recap. It's gonna be a mega one. Let me move this bulk and let's show you what we've got. So boom, obviously, look, we got this Ditto Full Art, we got the Bird Keeper there, Grim Snarl V Full Art Shiny, Toxtricity, another Bird Keeper. Why are the Bird Keepers in the tin? Maybe he's keeping the tin, but in DDV, baby, sh uh, full in DDV Full Art Shiny as well. So we did quite well on this opening, guys. If you wanna see, more of this uh let me know if you want me to do it with other products obviously we did the champions puff i think i did a 36 pack i'll put it on the screen if i did but i think i did the 36 pack opening of hidden fates already in my early days of this channel so but we got more openings if you're interested to see the pull rates from individual products different products this is the only product this is the only time we opened uh loose packs but obviously it is our custom eat um booster box opening so obviously you can see i use my famous grail tape etc but um yeah i hope you like this little concept of video uh, if you're new here, make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.